Hi, so my name is Lee Jones and I'm the Head of Sport at Martin College. So just taking some time today to show you around some of the amazing sport facilities we have at the college. So, as a sport as a department we have approximately 400 sport learners across um, further education and higher education level. Uh, this is made up of multiple different courses ranging from sports therapy, sports massage qualifications to sports science, fitness instructor and personal training qualifications, um, as well as the traditional level one, level two and level three sport qualifications as well. And we've also recently brought in public services both at level two and at level three for this September just gone. So within here at the college we also run uh, sports academies, so we run football academy, a rugby academy, a basketball academy, cricket and athletics as well. So as part of that structure, our students get to train at least three times a week with different qualified coaches. They also get access to a strength and conditioning coach as well that we employ on a full-time basis here at the college. So students not only get a chance to take part in the sports that they love, but they also get to train around the fitness side of things as well. So this is Holcourt Sports Hall. This is one of two sports halls here at the college and as you can see behind me is where we play our basketball games. So our basketball academy will play here uh, on, when, on match days on a Wednesday um, and we'll train uh, three days a week as well. Now we'll also have other academic sessions in here as well where we need to do practical sessions and that might be in the form of badminton or volleyball um, and as you can see at the very back of the court as well we've got cricket nets as well. So our cricket academy uh, will use this facility from time to time when they need to do training in the indoor kind of winter months but they will obviously train at Northampton County Cricket Club as well. So this is Holcott Gym and as you can see from behind me we've got lots of different resistance equipment here at the college. So we've got things from resistance machines to free weights, uh, we've got treadmills, we've got rowing machines um, and it gives our fitness instructor and our personal training students a real opportunity to learn how some of the different pieces of equipment that can be used in kind of a real kind of commercial area really. So this is predominantly used by our fitness courses. But we also do have our academy students that will also use it, particularly when they're injured. So they'll come up here with a physiotherapist and essentially uh, start working on some of the functional side of rehabilitation to try and get them kind of out onto the pitches as soon as possible, really. So this is a studio we've got here at the college which is just right next to Holcott Gym. So it's a really nice small space for us to use that we use as a warm up and conditioning area for students. But we also use it as well to run spinning classes and circuit training classes. So you can see in front of me we've got some spinning bikes. So our fitness instructors and our personal training students will learn how to be qualified spinning instructors by the time they leave here at the college. So here at the college we have multiple outdoor sports facilities. Um, as you can see from what we're standing on, this is one of our AstroTurf pitches. We actually have three AstroTurf pitches here at the college. We also have two outdoor rugby pitches, multiple football pitches, and we also have an outdoor uh, hardcore area as well that we use for different practical sessions as well. And these outdoor facilities will be used uh, throughout the entire week um, for academic lessons, sports academy training sessions, and also for match days as well when we bring other colleges from around the country here to uh, compete against us. So this is our athletics track. This is predominantly used by our athletics academy that will train here two to three times a week. Um, it's also used for lessons with different sports students when studying modules such as fitness training and fitness testing. And we'll also use this track as well when we do enterprise projects. So for example, we'll bring primary schools down in the summer months where we'll help to run and facilitate the sports day events that happen uh, for their school here at the college. So this is our strength and conditioning gym. As you can see behind me, we've got Olympic platforms. So it's traditionally a more strength and conditioning based gym rather than a commercial gym. So what that means is students will be involved in a lot more dynamic and explosive exercises such as squats, deadlifts, things like that. So the purpose behind that is that we're trying to improve the physical development of our students, particularly those that are on our sports academies. So our football and our rugby students are predominantly in here a lot of the time working on strength and speed type drills as well as our basketball academy um, and athletic students as well. In addition to that, we'll also have academic sessions in here as well. So our personal training students and our fitness instructing students will use this uh, for their practical sessions. So again, learning how to do certain exercises and how to instruct it to different members of the public. 
Our BTEC Level 3 students will also be involved as well when they're doing modules that involve fitness related stuff. And as you can see from the equipment, there's plenty to go around. This is our sports massage suite here at the college. So we run a variety of different qualifications that we use as facilities. So we run level three and level four sports massage qualifications. Uh, our sports science students will also use this in their second year of their study when they're studying sport injury and sport massage units. And then our degree level students will also use this predominantly for our sports therapy pathways as well. Uh, so other students that will also use this is, um, will be our academy athletes, so we run sports injury clinics here where predominantly our level 4 students and our degree level students will help to run and operate that, um, that injury clinic where students that have got kind of injuries or niggles can come to get diagnosed and they can also have pre-event and post-event sport massages as well.